The cases of airport expansion, known as Tulihao Airport, makes a deep impact on the environment as well as the social issue of relocation. This village of Ningombom have been relocated three times and this would be the fourth times. The daily source of income for this village is farming, fishing, vegetable vendors and small business. Now they have to leave everything they own including their land, their farm, their house and be relocated to a barren moor downhill without any drainage, water facilities, hospital or even school. Expansion of an airport is a Category A project and there are mandatory requirements for an environmental impact assessment to be done. There has to be a social impact assessment as well. But unfortunately in the case of Manipur, uh, what we have realized is that uh, they, have, they have started acquiring the land and people are already being displaced uh, without doing a proper environmental impact assessment. Can you imagine that you have been living in a house for from, from your grandparents' time and all of a sudden a government clerk comes with a paper saying that you've got to leave this house because we want to build something on it. I think this, this is a morally and ethically uh, very unfair. More than 400 families have been evicted. It's going to evict. Some have already got a compensation and however the compensation there are a lot of disparities inside. <laughs> And <laughs> Man now it is for the court to decide. Uh, the, the, the case is very clear, the law is very clear, the facts are very clear. But again, unfortunately, uh, the court is taking a long time to come out with uh, its final verdict on this uh, public interest litigation. People should be taken on board and, and the free, prior and informed consent of these people are a prerequisite before you start any of this project. Uh, that, that people have a, have a democratic right to protest uh, against government's policies and programs which affect them is, is a very fundamental tenet of democracy. And uh, we are finding that this, this democratic space is constantly being eroded in the context of the mega development and all this development uh, projects which is being rolled out today. Uh, for example, if we protest against the airport expansion, some of our activist friends also have been put in prison and comes uh, and they, they were charged the, uh, under the local uh, National Security Act, the NSA. How did you charge the Kongsari? Prajan to the Kongsari? Prajan, I took one sacrifice to win in Amatorin and Harry Mayor. May I wish you in an equidamo? Tadu, Sumi, Tadu, Hoji Tikka, the Tadu, Equizia, a Pombutari, Chin. Okuji, no, ah, cry. Government <laughs> The ways of procuring a land under the ages of 1894 Act established during the British rule need to be changed is my suggestion.
Why not call in both the parties under one table and chalk out the issue and problem for both the parties equally without injustice to either one? One who look up to the government for divine intervention. Where is the government when we are in need is the word they are asking and the eco holo is the only answer they get so far. This is Kami Mercy from Manipur reporting for India Unheard.